Hi everyone, my name is Jerome and I'm Head of Academic Alliance at Salonis. The Academic Alliance is our global partnership program for teachers and researchers. Together with my colleagues Payman, Muhammad, Thomas and Gabriel, we'd like to present you our brand new Process Repository application. Process Repository is a new product service offered by Salonis that serves process documentation purposes. Process Repository is available in our Intelligent Business Cloud and is natively linked to all other Salonis applications. On the one hand, Process Repository provides a centralized environment for documenting processes from mining. On the other hand, Process Repository allows you to store processes that are designed in various BPM tools or the ones that are saved in structured folders. Through these capabilities, Process Repository brings BPM and process mining closer together. I'd like to hand over to Payman, who is our responsible product manager for the Process Repository. Payman will guide you through this new application and all its features. Process Repository provides folder tree structure capability that enables forming the organizational process architecture by adding different levels of processes. Each category contains different attributes. The name and description are provided, as well as external or internal links that can be a SAP security guide or a Salonis process analysis to drill down and check the process performance. Users can add multiple attachments of supporting documents, such as process policies and guidelines. The commenting capability allows employees to better collaborate and communicate on process category level, and process responsibilities are shown in terms of process owner. Additionally, in order to increase the transparency, users can monitor all process changes in the history section and see what was changed in the category and who applied the changes. Next to the attributes, process categories can contain process models. This section enables the users to document business processes for the respective category. The model can be uploaded or modeled out of the box using the BPMN modeler. After viewing the BPMN, you can use the BPMN editor to make changes. And the versioning capability enables monitoring of different versions and track the process model changes in time. When processes are documented in the process repository, they can be retrieved in the Salonis process analytics. After opening the analytics, I can add a new sheet and add the conformance checker. Users can see various options for defining the target model, such as mining capabilities and retrieving the models from the process repository. This shows the list of stored process models in the repository and by selecting them I receive the model in the conformance checker to be compared against the discovered model. Additionally, users can document the mined or adjusted process models directly to the repository. By clicking on save model in the repository they can select the desired category and the process model or by creating a new process model. The capabilities of process documentation support various use cases such as system migration and audit and compliance by bringing process mining and BPM closer to each other. Thanks a lot Payman for this great introduction to the process repository. At the end of this tutorial, you might wonder how you can use it. For all academics, I'd like to invite you to sign up for the IBC Academic Edition via salonis.com slash academic alliance. Or you just reach out to the Academic Alliance team via academic alliance at salonis.com. For all industry users, I'd like to invite you to sign up for Salonis Snap, our free open platform, and reach out to the Snap team. So I wish you all happy process mining and happy modeling. Thank you.